Hi everyone, I am Mariana and I am the founder of Little Maven Lemonade. And as the people put it so well, we started at Hope in Maine. Um, it was just a little dream of can we even make this a business? Can, is this even possible? And at Hope in Maine, we were able to develop our recipe to really start to scale. And then when it actually came time to scale and and we needed more resources, we needed more, more funding. I met with Ina Walker from Brookshire Bank and then we were able to go through the motions and get a um, line of credit, which I was denied by every single bank that I walked into because we don't have the big purchase orders, we don't have the, the big tax returns, we are not asking for half a million dollars. And the bigger banks, does, from my experience, and I know that's the experience of a lot of my, of my peers in the industry, and let me lie on this one um, where you know the big banks do not work with us and it's extremely important to have those community banks that they are interested in knowing the business they are interested in knowing us and our journey and how can they become a partner and that has been my experience with Berkshire Bank to the point where I can call Ina anytime I can email her I know she's gonna pick up the phone she's gonna talk to me she's gonna walk through the problem and trying to find a solution with me where can i mention banks okay <laughs> as my experience with citizens bank for instance which is you know headquartered here and i've been um a client of of citizens i think since i moved to this country in 2000 too long ago um <laughs> More than a decade, and the moment that I walked in there and asked for a simple line of credit, twenty-five hundred dollars, five thousand dollars, and the answer was an immediate no because we did not have any proof, even though I've been a client forever. So today, actually, I'm actually closing my account with uh, Citizens Bank and moving all of the business um, accounts to Berkshire Bank, thanks to Ina. Uh, we're making this final transition. So thank you so much to everybody here that support the work of the local banks that makes our dream come true because we couldn't do it without you guys.